As you do more questions with me, you'll find out that I really love things that have to do with human physiology. Human physiology being anything to do with uh, uh, the human organs, etc. And the first one we're going to talk about now is outline the control of the heartbeat. And you want to talk about, first of all, um, the area of the heart, which is called the pacemaker, which controls the heartbeat. This pacemaker is not a mechanical pacemaker, but it is just a bit of tissue which controls electrical impulses. It's located in the right atrium. And it stimulates first the atria to contract and then the ventricles after so that you have, you have um, controlled contraction. And then this allows blood to be pumped out of the heart in a very efficient way. Now, after you talk about this, after you talk about the ventricles contracting after the atrial contraction, you want to talk about what things can increase the heartbeat and what things can decrease the heartbeat. And there are two main things. First of all, it is nerves. Nerves are very important. And you can write that next as your, as your next line. Nerves can stimulate the heart. And then you want to give examples of things that can, or, or neurotransmitters involved with nerves that can increase the heartbeat and then decrease the heartbeat. So whenever you think of things that can increase the heartbeat, you think of adrenaline or noradrenaline. So noradrenaline is a key neurotransmitter involved in speeding up the heartbeat. And think about that in terms of, oh, whenever you have an adrenaline rush, things, you know, you get sweaty, you get hot, your heart starts to beat faster. On the other hand, then you also have neurotransmitters which can slow down the heartbeat. And these are neurotransmitters involved with the parasympathetic nervous system. And this one is acetylcholine. That can slow down the heartbeat. After you've talked about nerves, then you want to move into hormones. What hormones can stimulate the heartbeat? And the key one is, is one called adrenaline. So we talked about noradrenaline before, which is a neurotransmitter. Well, adrenaline is a hormone, and it's released from the adrenal glands and causes an increased heart rate. Think of fight or flight response. Think of sympathetic nervous system. Think of increasing the heart rate. Write all of these points down, and then you'll get the six marks as uh, uh, that you should be able to get.